facing a kind of mass unconsciousness, or at least a requirement, I should perhaps clarify, for a new consciousness that is not being born, I think that we are starting to experience what happens with overt secularism. And when you talk about the experience that can happen in a sort of secular culture, congregationally, in a theatre, it's something that most people don't have a version of. I know that there are sort of a lot of people that have a religious faith, certainly in America, but it feels to me that we don't have a shared set of values anymore that, that allow us to have inclusivity, that allow us to acknowledge that human beings are by default fallible. The salts and its in line that the, the, the line between good and evil runs not between nations and creeds and races, but through every human heart. The possibility for redemption, the possibility for failure, the possibility for growth. Even if we like take where we started this conversation, moving from a position of broadly accepting the measures were necessary in order to countenance a new and novel threat, to hang on, we've given too much authority to people they're not even playing by the rules of science that they laid out for us as being the, the reason for these measures. But that, that conversation isn't possible anymore. And We're the not. same thing's playing out around Russia, the same thing's playing out around conversations around gender and identity, that censorship and the granting of this sort of paternal authority to a state that always offers us safety, to a, a corporate sector that always offers us convenience, all the while, I think, banalizing the human experience turning us into data, extracting the possibility for wild and organic connections between one another and, and, and a connection to the planet. Unless, unless this conversation really broadens out and allows a little, a little polarity and allows a little bit of mud in, but we're going to end up somewhere sort of sanitary but very ugly. It's a new religion. <clears throat> this is acting like a religion. Yeah. It's the dogmatic. It's yeah. absolute. It's if you do not believe in it, you yeah. are condemned to hell. It's, you know, maybe this is, I mean, it's, maybe this is a new religion. Yeah, that's, that's, you think that it's being, it's being posed as politics, but it's behaving like a religion. Seems like it. It seems like uh, it has some of those aspects, at least. I think it's worth thinking about. Did you know that I used the word apostasy at the very beginning? I did. I was very impressed. Thank you. Thanks.